the hell are you trying to say about that shit? He goes, well, what are you getting my shit for? I said, well, what the fuck is that about? What are you trying to promote with that, right? And I was busting his balls because I was pretty fucked. Yeah, we were all. <laughs> and then he got up, pissed off, and left. I said, what's the fuck's up with that, dude? To, to the kid in Chicago. Oh. The kid said, and it was just kind of... oh, really? I said, he's a fucking cop. Yeah. <laughs> no, but the, you put us in a position where we're over here getting out with a cop. <laughs> but the funniest wow. moment for me, that, that whole trip was like, you know, it was basically like a group of us, me and Russell and a few other people, standing around talking to Kate. And I was, she was in a super kind of PC mode at that point, and we were yeah, worried yeah. about offending uh, her. Lives. And I was still kind of right. like, I, and I remember like she was like, so what? What do you guys do with the chicken? You guys have put the chicken in someone's yard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I thought we were yeah, yeah. So, oh, yeah. No, we thought the chicken was going to be completely taken care of. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah. yeah. We were yeah. totally responsible. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Somehow yeah. it flew. But Somehow it, it get it got the nerf to fly over the fence. No, it, was it wasn't. It wasn't chain. our fault. We got hit by a car. It was a three foot chain. Yeah, chickens can fly. <laughs> yeah, about, <laughs> about three feet. About three feet. Three to five feet high. Okay, so so you know we're talking and and you know Kate says to me like. So what do you guys do about the chicken? I was like, and I knew you guys were doing something totally stupid. So I was, I was like, you know, deer in the headlights. And I was like, oh, I think Tom's taking care of that. Yeah. And then like, on, on, on fucking yeah. cue, Tom walks in the room with an envelope. And he goes, here you go, Russell. And it was filled with feathers. And oh, Russell like opened Jesus. it and it was like. <laughs> I don't remember this. <laughs> hey, I could have. Go- I but I thought, I I thought Russell said, can we go by the house just to visit the chicken yeah. one more time? Isn't <laughs> no, that true? No, no. Well, and that's, how we, found that, that's how we found out it was no, flat That's how we found out the chicken was flat in the street. Okay, yeah. no, but that, that, no, Russell was, Russell didn't know. The way we're at Russell found out was Tom came, came in with, that, with, an, envelope, with an envelope full oh, of feathers. Oh, Russell wasn't there when we yeah. went down and went, went checked yeah. out the chicken. Yeah, and, and, and Tom comes in laughing <laughs> with, a, with, a, with an envelope full of feathers and hands it to Russell. This was on Russell you started the weeping. Yeah. Up he, was, he was very attached to the chicken. <laughs> yeah. Russell was having a really hard he was, time. He did have a tight time. So it really would have been interesting if you'd have served it up. So bad, you can't <laughs> even yeah. imagine. Yeah. But, but no. Okay, all right. You're, you're a better man than I. So bad. That and a shot and a glass of beer at this moment with this group of people and a cigarette would be amazing. Yeah, it would. <laughs> and I'm not doing any of that right now. Uh, I was doing the cigarette, but not the shot of beer. And then I really. really so, you know, that's, so uh, I don't know, I, man. I, I, what you do know. you think? I think we just get together on August. We Hi, make, Rachel. We, we list Everybody a bunch of stuff we're going to do. And now until then, right. Well, yeah. Well, see, I mean, we have a, everybody's got each other's emails and stuff. I'll right. be forwarding. You know, I'm going to put, I'm going to put like, just the general ideas of what well, we're talking listen, about. Well, listen, think on, it so is. Can if watch we, it. let's say we went to enter with sandwich boards, <laughs> you can think about what you'd want on your sandwich board. If you think this is a, a worthwhile notion, I just feel like. I, the, I don't know why the sandwich board came. It's like you you know retired out of work, picketing, whatever. Just oh, you mean on your wearing wearing a sandwich board and think about some obnoxious thing you want to do on your sandwich board. Like I'm thinking about the abortion people with the signs and things and all this, and we're like meatballs and like what are we anti 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 work employment anti I don't know. I think maybe anti-nostalgia would be good. I know. It's <laughs> Considering. Anti-nostalgia. This whole yeah. thing is about nostalgia. Exactly. Nostalgia. That would be Everything a perfect thing. Anti-sellable yeah. art. What was that? I told them we're going so to have an anti-sellable art. Anti-sellable art. Great. Oh, they, they're up for the idea. That okay. works for me. I mean, that's yeah. pretty much all we did anyway. Yeah, do. but even if we say anti-nostalgia, you just can't say anti-nostalgia. you got to exactly. do it in a way that's a little bit more... Well, it can't just be that. Right? No, right. it can't it's gotta be. But well, we can that. have what is what are nostalgic images, for example? What would you consider nostalgic images? Of what? Of meatballs? Of anything? I don't know what yeah. what it symbolizes nostalgia. nostalgia. Well, you know, Actually, no. it's always for most people. It's, it's a thought. So it's hard. Right. To, it's hard, hard to you can't nail it because if that it's is different for thought, different people. Yeah. If you, if, it ain't, if if you put something on there and it doesn't mean anything. Well, I mean. Yeah. Fuck meatballs, fluxus would be anti nostalgia. Yeah. The audience? It's, I don't what? Know. Well, it's the rocket. It's, it's, it's going to be a lot of people our age who used to go to the rocket. Yeah. That's pretty much it. Yeah, it's going to be. 
It's, well, it's at the Roots Cafe. Oh. What is that? But, but it, the it's, whole thing it's is celebrating old, the rock. Where the old uh, Black Rep was, oh, I believe. Down the street here? Uh, yeah, oh. we're, we're, it's the one. That's which the one is Roots, it? Roots, the old Black Rep. The, the old Black Rep, yeah, around the corner. So that's a big enough space. Oh, yeah. yeah. They're going to pack it, I guarantee you. They're yeah. going to have bring it back a whole bunch of bands. And yeah, like Juxo so is going to be playing yeah, that night. Gonna be, and, uh, it's going to be a yeah. lot of yeah, yeah. fun. But the only, you know, this is actually the, what you just said about the nostalgia thing. The only thing that would keep this from, from, from me to enjoy this whole event is if it's too much nostalgic. Yeah. yeah. So I think this anti-nostalgia is an interesting theme, actually. So at that point, we shouldn't really reference anything that we used to do, like, at that point, for I, I this, for this totally one. Knew I, I yeah. told totally him that I can't yeah. imagine that this group of people, if we can even get them all together, would be have any interest in doing anything we've done. Yeah. Right. At funny. least for this, yeah. Yeah, yeah. To, to, to go pull something out that was done. At first, that was the first thought, because it's natural to go back to, I, okay, what do we do? I don't think we had a great experience when we tried that here. What did we do here? Remember we did a retro show once? Oh, that was during a, uh, it was like a, it was like one of the, one of the fool's balls or something. We did, yeah. It was okay. Well, you know, again, it was, yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. We just dragged out a bunch of pieces and redid them. See, but a new piece is always good. It's always good, exciting because you. I think you know, like, you know, it may suck. It may suck. You may in your heart know it sucks, but it's only confirmed by the audience. I don't remember that. <laughs> I mean, There's still hope. If it was for a fool's ball, probably not. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Well, well, what what was the first fool's ball? Yeah. Here? Yeah. It had to be like maybe four, five. Totally new. Or we should reference everything we did. Well, that's the thing. It's either nothing at all, all or nothing, really. Well, in that regard. No, it's maybe a way. I don't know. Like, without doing that. Well, there's got to be. Well, you know what you do. You figure right. out a way to, like, you know. To tell you the truth, a lot of the pieces. I don't know if this informs this conversation at all. But a lot of the pieces that we did, when I talk about them to young people, they sound far more fucking interesting than they were when we did them. <laughs> yeah, we right. did them yeah. A lot of them. Yeah. Not to say that we didn't do some really incredible stuff that might have been a little bit ahead of the audience at the time in Providence, mm -hmm. oh, as yeah. far as I'm concerned. Yeah. You know, I think I think we could actually well, entertain I mean, people whole, far like, more. Flash mob thing, which is like, exactly. we, we did that oh, shit. please. We, we did that long before well, it was a thing. We did that oh. the, yeah. We did, yeah, there was, there was the, one thing we did where the audience asked us to stop. That... Which that could be the audience. There's we a did the audience. a wall of words. It was like, there is no time but the blah, blah, blah. Well, there is no time but the present. And we went on and on and on. And, and then when they thought it was over, they were applauding and we kept going. And then they were like, finally, people in the audience started yelling, stop. Yeah. And they meant it. You know, you know, so, so um, Athens, that Georgia, was there was well, also a we thing. Did that in Athens, Georgia, we completely lost the audience. It was one of the coldest. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Show I've that was one of the, on that tour. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that um, that Bill so Reed actually had a, an interesting uh, uh, remembrance of one of the things we had done, where we picked someone out of the audience, and this was at Richmond Street. Yeah. And it was we picked a girl out of the audience, just that random, and we basically insulted the shit out of her on stage. Because, oh, you're, how, how, why are you so fat? And we made her cry. Oh, he said it was the worst thing he had ever seen. He said, he said it, 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 it threw a pall over the entire I evening. Don't remember I don't remember it at all, I but evidently. Hated, hated, uh, but I thought it was. But, no, because who was the girl that was definitely? No. Emily. 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 It, Emily. It was a, she was a she, plant, right? She was a plant. Yeah, yeah. but she, and she got very upset. Oh, yeah, no, she she, she cried. Yeah, but it was one of us. She was, you know, she was kind of like one of us. Yeah. But for, for some reason or other, one, and she knew what we were going to do, but when we started doing it, yeah. it got yeah. her. It got her. Yeah, no, it's, yeah, it got her. If you're dumb enough to volunteer for something <laughs> like that, you deserve <laughs> they, whatever Well, that's the thing. It's like, you know, it's, 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 they it's like knew, going the military. They kind of knew yeah. what they were getting into, but I just don't remember, but I thought that was an interesting I, 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 one. I just you know, remember sort of talking like, to her afterwards, and, yeah. and she just, it just upset her. It just her killed her. It, she, it just, yeah. like, I don't yeah. know, I, I don't know if I was involved with that. I can't remember. I don't remember the timeline of it. Um, I do remember the, the questions and answers thing, where we asked, we came out and asked if anyone had any questions or anything. And I'll, when I'll anyone asked the question, we would just, that. we had this fun. ominous drone, and then we were just, we all stared at them. It was just, a, that's good. Yeah. Well, it's that's intimidating because awesome. you don't know what the hell we're going to do. You know, we could do yeah. Dude, we could do that for a half hour. Just put a drone and just stand there and look at people for a half an yeah. hour. That would fuck them right up. <laughs> yeah, it's like, you know, it was like in the middle of it. was that, that show where we had that set of music where we did like a, that he was a good Greek. Oh, good, yeah, good Greek. Yeah, yeah, the, the opera. Wasn't it the opera? 
It wasn't a full Whatever opera, the fuck you would call it. I mean, yeah, you know, yeah. as far as I opera goes. Yeah, yeah. I'm just part of the song about the Sands of Iwo Jima.